Clock in, clock in. Black got to just walked in. Yeah. He already dead. It ain't no need to check his fighters, bitch. I had somebody pull up some shit. He already dead. It ain't no need to check his fighters. Yeah. Crunch time. Yeah, nigga. It's lunch time. Let go. Crunch time. Yeah, nigga. It's lunch time. Let go. Yeah. Crunch time. Yeah, nigga. It's lunch time. Let go. Let go. Crunch time. Yeah, nigga. It's lunch time. He dead. Team Black got to stand up, man. Yeah. We about to take a look at this video with Trouble, bro. This video proves Trouble knew all about the situation that caused him his life. You feel me? Came across this video. I don't we check it out and see if Trouble actually did knew what was coming his way. Cause I was not paying attention to the situation whatsoever at all. You feel me? I heard about it. Uh, Trouble. A lot of people know him, bro. Bro having big motion, heavy rotisserie chick. Feel me? He kind of. I ain't hear from him in a minute until the situation popped up. I ain't gonna lie, but um, let's check this video out. Welcome back to the channel once again, fam. What I can tell you is that um, Mr. Morel Orr, which is the victim, was visiting a female friend at the um, complex. Um, and Mr. Jamichael Jones um, did know the female, and it was a domestic situation. Hey, I'm going to keep you straight with you. Really don't get off about your pair, right? And then about what happened before me. But the reason why a lot of y'all don't get taken serious because Y'all still be consistently fucking them two, three of them we be knowing. You might not know that we know these because I fuck. I hope my man did not make a whole video about the exact girl who house he pulled up on. Cause you feel me? A lot of times when people make little uh stories like this, they're talking about somebody, but speaking in general at the same time. Bam. Hopefully it wasn't one of them two or three niggas who had them popped up and pulled up at the house. You feel me? Shorty, I wouldn't say she purposely set him up. She low-key did it accidentally. If we gonna even put that out there. You know what I'm talking about? Because damn, set up is set up. But she did the stupidest shit ever. You feel me? Ain't no way in hell the nigga you was messing with before this dude had the key to your house. Don't be a dumb man. This man had the whole key to your house. This man walked slap into your house, man. That nigga fixed the sandwich before he even walked in the room. That shit is crazy. That shit is blowing my mind. Nigga walked in that bed, probably took his shoes off, thought he was finna get some ass and walked in the room. They were laying together. Ain't no telling what the hell happened. With on a day to day basis, you don't see me with the people I talk to or who I got real relationship, real time with. You don't see me with them. But y'all be fucking two, three of them. So of course, they're going, you know what I mean? We just gonna keep the one together, bitch. I still, I fuck with y'all, you know what I mean? I got nothing against you. I ain't gonna never shame your name, no none of that. I ain't never been part of my campaign. I never shame your name. But I recognize game, so I back with state. But at the same time, like, bro, fuck, bro, you gotta keep that shit gangster with a bitch if, like, if you fucking with her, you like her like that, like, you just gotta tell her, like, bitch, stop. Like, please, just stop. Don't do that. <laughs> like, don't do that no more. Like, dead fear. Hell no! If you gotta tell a bitch, stop, don't do that, y you stop. Q don't do that, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Hell no! And you feel me? Much love for trouble, but I'm trying to figure out what does he mean by kick the one? Because I hopefully he don't. My nigga. Because look, this is what I'm getting from what happened. You feel me? He came from the club. I don't know if it's a random whoop the whoop, but I know it's a whoop the whoop he be whoop the whooping with. You feel what I'm saying? And he ended up whoop the whooping, fell asleep, no blick, no nothing. Probably was gone. And this man came in and, and, and shot. Nine times out of ten, that man probably didn't even know he was shooting trouble. This nigga probably thought he was just showing somebody who was sleeping with his girl. And when he probably seen everything blowing up on the end, they like, damn, I done fucked up. I done killed him man by this thought. Ain't no way. Well, that shit be coming out like a Joseph, but I be dead serious. Yeah, my own life. Like, you just gotta keep it gangster with her. If she just can't stop dogging, all right, going on about your bitch, homie. Just going on about it. Going on about your Gucci Mane sadly reacts to Atlanta rapper Troubles' untimely passing. R.I.P. He simply tweeted alongside a sad face emoji. A frequent collaborator of Troubles, Young Scooter, also paid tribute to his fallen friend, posting a portrait of the late artist wearing a white and red polo shirt with tons of flashy jewelry on him. Damn, Scoob. Rest up, my boy, he wrote. Bow Wow has also shown his late friend love on social media. Trouble was my dog, he began. Pulled up anywhere I was at. Didn't care if it was last minute. He was there. I can't believe this. 
What's going on, man? My condolences to his family. Bro had kids, man. And that's the end of the quote, but man. Bro had kids, man. Bro had a life, man, and now he doesn't. It's ridiculous, dude. Ridiculous. He was recently signed to Duct Tape Entertainment label and had a slew of successful records. But I guess talking about the accomplishments doesn't exactly do any good in the face of what's happened. But man, man, man. Once again, as you if you've been following us for the reporting of this incident, then you know I don't really have much to say at this point. Aside from just the stupidity of the world, the willingness to pull a weapon instead of use your words, whatever the situation may be. Because I'm not going to pretend like I know what happened. I'm not going to pretend like I was there. And also, if you hear any background noise, just know your boy's not in the recording studio this time. On a little vacation. But again, that doesn't stop the news. But it doesn't change the fact that everything about this entire situation, to me, makes no sense. And even when it does make sense, it won't make sense. Damn, man. Trouble, trouble, trouble. What the hell is really going on right now, y'all? Folks is getting killed out here, bro, by females, diss songs, verses, everything, bro. I'm just confused right now, bro. Damn, man. Everybody got to use these situations as an eye-opener, bro, and use it to capitalize in your own situation, you feel me? Hopefully, somebody close to trouble and uh like a lot of these rappers that have been moving wrong hopefully they homeboys who's up next could learn from these situations and hopefully they people that look up to them you feel me learn from these situations and and, and not go through the same shit cause i'm confused as hell bro i need some milk i'm finna go get some in the booby you feel me but they handle business first uh let me know how y'all feel about this in the comment below though i'm about done with that Real confused with that. So if y'all could give me some advice on the situation, you feel me? That'll like open my eyes up and, and, and let me see why shit going on like this. I will be satisfied because I'm confused. So if anybody has any satisfying information, you can let me get that. Don't try no hoe. You hear where I'm from? You feel what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about? On Tutty Ho, man. On Tutty Ho, man. On Dutt, man. They playing a slimy game, man. You feel what I'm saying? You got bees on your bees on your Q's and P's. Stays on your ones and twos, y'all. You feel me? I'm counting on y'all to keep it a hundred. Only chasing after these stinking up all the ass 